Hello, in this video I will show you how to build the newly released Windows Terminal from Microsoft. At this time you need to build the application yourself, but it is expected to be released by the end of this year. Windows Terminal is a new terminal application from Microsoft that has tabs, multiple profiles, colors, text resizing, transparency and a lot of features which makes it similar with the best terminal emulators from Linux and macOS. In order to be able to use the Windows Terminal application you will need at least Windows 1903 which is going to be released this month in a matter of days. If you are like me and can't wait until the official release of 1903, you can install Windows Insiders Edition, which will let you build and use the new terminal application. Open a console window and check what build version of Windows 10 you have. If the number starts with 10.0.18, you should be OK. Next, go to Settings, Update and Security for Developers and make sure that the Developer Mode is enabled. You will need this to be able to install the Windows Terminal application. In order to build the actual application, you will need Visual Studio 2019. Go to Visual Studio website and get the installer. Open your Downloads folder and start the installer. You will need to select at least two workloads, Desktop Development with C++ and the Universal Windows Platform Development. Make sure you also check the MSVC V141 build tools. Next, select the Universal Windows Platform Development. Check the C++ V141 Universal Windows Platform tools. Finally, check the Windows SDK version that matches your Windows build version, which in my case is 10.0.18.36.2. Now press install. I'll pause the video until the installation is done. Now you can optionally sign in and select the look and feel of Visual Studio. You can also leave this to the defaults. Next we'll need to install Git for Windows. Start the installer and accept the defaults. Go to the GitHub page for the Windows Terminal and copy the link to the repository. Next, open a console window and create a working folder in which we'll keep the source code for the Windows Terminal. Now, clone the Windows Terminal repository. Go inside the Terminal folder and get the remaining parts of the code. Now we are done. Open the terminal folder in Windows Explorer. Double click on the Open Console Solution file and open it with Visual Studio 2019. Change the Windows SDK version to match the version of your Windows and change the second option to No Upgrade. Press Install and wait until Visual Studio Installer gets the required libraries. Choose Yes. Press Install. Now change the architecture to x64 and the build to release. Select the Cascadia package solution. Use the build menu to build the solution and wait until the compilation finishes. The build has finished successfully. From the build menu, choose Deploy Solution and wait until you see the confirmation message. Now we are done. You can find the newly installed Windows Terminal in the Windows Start menu. You can press Ctrl T to open a new tab and see the Terminal menu. Thanks for watching and please like, share and subscribe.